Hello everybody and welcome back to the Mega Modded series. We are back again and in the previous episode I said we were going to play as Tainted Andromeda because we got the double Eden's Blessing and the Eden's Leaf for the two extra items and an extra trinket. So I'm hoping, I was just about to say, hoping it provides, we get the pocket scale for extra foil cards, we get this little bastard, <laughs> but we got Pascal Candle. I can safely say Pascal Candle's pretty good. <laughs> The rest of that, I'm not sure. I'm not so sure about. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I kind of, I can, I, for a second there, I completely forgot how this character works. Excuse me. Yeah. So, our little fella is gonna do his best to ruin our run. Um, good for him. It's gonna take me a little bit of getting used to. I really hope I don't get like an early death here, um, because I, I really want to keep these items and said trinket. Uh, especially Pascal, um, but it's certainly plausible that we just die here because I am, in a word, bad at things. But we at least get some red hearts here that Singularity unfortunately cannot pick up. But this character benefits highly, highly from high fire rate uh, because he can have higher fire rate than most characters. It'd be nice if the game would give us, there you go, I've just got to say, some um, some pennies. Unfortunately, we can't actually reach any of those. So for those of you that haven't seen the character showcase, by the way, this character is very bizarre, as you can see. Fires from a black hole in the center of the room. The tears that he fires orbit around you. He cannot gain items via normal means. Item rooms no longer contain items. Instead, we have to get pickups like pennies to charge our active. It's the only way to charge it. As you are currently seeing, we are being majorly shafted by the fact that like we're not getting any consumables from anything as a penny so we can feasibly get quite a lot of items and one thing to note as well is we can actually abuse item pools to get better items with this character so that's even better um although secret rooms cannot be fully abused because the, yeah it has diminishing returns to stop people going crazy i don't actually know what health i'm on right now i think this character starts with two black hearts which I think means I'm currently on either one and a half or one black heart. But as you can see, with this this current fire rate, things are popping off. Things are going well. Um, very, very happy. I would very much like to blow up that, um, or get into those rocks. But I don't know how likely any of that is to happen. We really got to take advantage of every little source. Every little bit of squeeze we can get out of this character to get as many items as possible. But, I actually think, as long as we don't make too many really dumb mistakes here, we've actually got a very, very good start. Just because our fire rate's going to be absurd for the most part. It's very, very easy for us to get hit, I will say, just because the, the nature of this character means that you play, you have to play a bit weirdly. And of course, we have this guy. Do remember, though, lucky, lucky, we get an item, full item charge upon, um, upon killing a boss. So, I'm just going to use it in a regular room, see what we get. We get the spinning scent. Uh, follows enemies, damages them, may spawn pickups. Honestly, any single way that we can gain extra pickups, should have destroyed those poops, by the way, is an absolute win for us. Now, we do not want to be entering item rooms at all. But yeah, it's going to be an absolute win for us because if we can manage to get uh, actually pick those things up, unlike these bombs here, they do fade we can actually get charges out of that. So that's going to be majorly useful. I don't know. What, what the hell are these little... What was this little fly? What the hell was that? There's a, there's a big dude and lots of small dudes. I don't really know what's going on here. There's another penny. But yeah, we're kind of in the market to just get as many items as we possibly can, really. Enemies that chase us are going to be problematic, as you can probably imagine. We might as well open this up, you know, because they likely have consumables. Of course, it has a chest and we don't have any keys anymore. Um, God damn it. <laughs> of course. We'll, we'll, we'll go back to that if we get another key, though. I just basically want to stay the hell away from my BBF. The good thing is, because we fire from the center of the room, we actually have a much easier time of staying away from that big fat fella. He's going to be a bit of a bastard to us, but... Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, 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 oh. That scared the bejeebus out of me. the bejeebus out of me. Now, the spinning coin is pr proving to be a little difficult to use, but otherwise not too bad. Now, we will try and get a secret room item here. We get one guaranteed, so we'll hopefully get our secret room 
relatively quickly here. I'm imagining it's here now. It's not. I'm a little dumbfounded by where it is then. Okay. Um, I'm just going to use this. Do you know what, Sprinkler? I don't know how Sprinkler's going to work here. But it's it's certainly going to be interesting. But yeah, as for, as for our uh, sort of question that we normally ask in most of our episodes here. What's your guys' um, favourite modded character I've showed off so far? Out of the character showcases and such. What's been your what, what's been the one that comes to mind as like your favourite? I might have asked that question before, I'll, I'll admit. But I'm going to ask it again. Right. How does this work? Okay, it works exactly as I thought. It fires them directly from the centre of the room, which I love. Really wish we could get the penny to work a little better for us here, but it's a little difficult to. But yeah, this is this is a lot of tears coming out here. I love this. I love this. The fact that we're able to direct them as well is really nice. We of course got a devil deal here, so we'll uh, we'll pop in here and see if we can get anything out of that. First of all, let's see if we can destroy these fires. Might be able to get a penny or so. Nothing, unfortunately. We got something very very nice. Oh ho ho. Okay, this is incredible for multiple reasons. Main one being, oh, also, Devil Deal is now closed? Why is the Devil Deal there? Why is the door there if it's closed? That's I've never I don't have I ever seen that before? That's weird. But this is really good for one main reason. Obviously the secondary is it's a pretty good damage up. But the main main reason Library start of items in them, okay. Uh, it's kind of obvious, to be fair. Uh, the main main reason is our tier size is massive, which is going to significantly increase the ease at which we hit enemies, which is the hardest thing to do as this character. Of all the downsides this character has, actually physically hitting enemies is very difficult. Do you know, if we don't get some health soon, actually, we are going to die. And the game did provide for me there, which is nice. Um, we get this. I'll use you there. And we get this, which I can use somewhere else. But can we stop getting pins, please? They've already hurt me once. But yeah, very, having a very, very easy time of hitting enemies, which is just a godsend. Unfortunately, we have been hit, which means our fire rate is lowered for a short time. Luckily, that short time isn't significant. Because it, it charges up pair... It, it like ticks back up her room. Makes things a little easier for us, but just look at this. Able to hit those poops like there's nothing wrong. Beautiful. And also just the scythes are just amazing visually too, which is pretty nice. I'm just, I'm, I'm constantly scared of my BBF. I swear whenever you get like a cool Eden's Blessing star, it's always a little bit of a like, hey, fuck you. A uh, dream catcher here. Um... Preventing a chance for a curse. I think I'm fine, thank you. I think I'm happy with my increased foil card chance, even if it is seemingly not doing anything for us so far, but any additional chance is going to be happy for us. I'm having a really hard time seeing at the minute, as in, like, anything that's going on. <laughs> Just because our tiers are pretty massive. Healthy is really nice. Shop items are very valuable, I'll say that for sure. Drop items are very valuable. So we'll pop this in here. And we got Tarot Cloth, which is potentially pretty good. There you go. There's our first foil card. And it's a doubled foil card too. So I'm going to try and get this fire rate up here. There you go. Boom, bow. And Nugget's kind of a weird one. If I can get the money, I'm willing to give it a go. I, I w <sighs> Yeah, I'm willing to give it a go. Right. The chariot here is uh, going to be... Grant Stompy for the room gives you temporary invincibility. I don't really care about that, I'll be honest. Um, okay. Item room is whatever. We do we do have to remember we're gaining planetarium chances we make our way through here. So we want to be searching the floor to see if we get that planetarium. Extra keys here is rather nice. I'm going to blow this up because it should get this guy. It missed. Oh, that's so annoying. I thought that I'd get him. I really thought that I'd get him. Nice amount of charges there. Look at the size of my tears. It's absolutely beautiful. Oh, we did get a pretty cool item here. Oh, how did that bomb hit me? Game, you've got to be kidding me right now. This is, I'm getting so screwed over. So, this is interesting. We got Curse of the Stars here. 
Curse of the Stars is a really good item. Permanently gives you Curse of the Blind. Rerolls all low quality items. Yeah, I think I think we go for it. I think we go for it. I I am just in a perpetual state of agony about my HP though. Like it has been so low. Basically now I'm hoping that Tarot Cloth provides us with a good amount of health through some means. What what card that may be, we do not know. But I really hope it provides, because we are very much on the verge of death. Right, careful here, because uh, I was just about to say it doesn't matter. Okay, so let's go for a, a regular old item here. I don't know what quality that is by the indication colour, but we'll take it. Oh, God. That's terrible. <laughs> Oh, no, no, no. That's so bad. <laughs> oh, no. We, we, we had a very, very good run. And we have ruined it. Because our bombs now fly back towards us. Which is... Basically, we have just made ourselves the Ipecac, um Boomerang Tears synergy. So that's fun. Glad... <laughs> Glad we brought this evil upon ourselves. Explosive diarrhea, just for a few more bombs, you know. Didn't have enough of those already. So, yeah, um, we did get a quality four item. Do you know what? Do you know what? Do you know what? Why in the bloody hell? Why in the bloody hell did I use sprinkler in this room? What was I thinking would be the benefit? What was I thinking would possibly be a, a reasonable time? To use that. Oh my god, we have destroyed this run. It's it's all about survival of the fittest now. We have many explosions to be avoiding on a regular basis. Oh for fuck we're dead. We're so unbelievably dead. Like basically if we don't get explosion immunity like right fucking now <laughs> we are so burned. Also this is a great room for charges. Rejection. I don't know what that does. Please give me an item that's going to give me some HP here. I, I desperately need it. Please, please, please. Fucking Pyro! <laughs> Man. Pyro. We could have had lack like just 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 for just for visuals sake. Let's just take a second to remove Dr. Fetus. Look at this. Look at this beauty we could have had. Look at this absolute delight of a run. This just glorious, glorious run we could have had. But instead, we got Dr. Fetus, which not only doesn't have synergies, but is literally the worst possible item you could get as this character. I, 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 I cannot think of a single item that is more detrimental to a run. I, I just, I can't believe it. It's, it saddened me to my core. Like, I can barely hit anything, and I keep hitting my damn self. Blank gives a soul heart. I'm pretty happy about that. Oh my god. I, I, I can't even destroy these fires efficiently. Okay, we're getting a lot of health now, which is nice. Also, Pascal Candle, near useless now. It's always good. It's always fun. Silver ring. That's a damage up, at least. The anger that I feel for this game right now is nothing short of insane. Oh, good. Good, good, good. 
I was really hoping for a little fucking delirium. Oh my god. I mean, I'm glad we've managed to bolster our health somewhat. We've gotten a good amount of HP. But, like, could this game not be quite so racist? Ah, you absolute... The fuck am I meant to do? Bedside Queen is keys, right? Bedside Queen is keys? I think it... Uh, my phone is going off like crazy. One minute. Nope, it's not. It's just lying to me. Yeah, it is keys. Yeah. Raven's Beak. Consumes all pickups in the room but gives a small but permanent damage upgrade. Cool. Literally an anti-synergy with this character. That's always fun. I, I just... My, my, my disappointment is immeasurable and my day is ruined. Ah! We need an out. We need an out, and we need it real heckin' soon. I'm trying to think. Apart from explosive immunity, I, I don't know what our out is. Man. Just... Maybe we just stop firing forever? Maybe that's our out. I never fire again. Honestly, buy the card. It could be Hierophant. It's Hanged Man. Actually? Speed down. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, Oh, look down as well. Oh, boy. Fire towards the, I want to check for the secret room! Ah! I have to use my real bombs. God damn it. Right. Let's let's make our way back over here and see what's what, shall we? Oh, oh a tinted rock. A tinted rock. How beautiful it is to see. What is going on with my minimap API? Why would I ever want this? And then my timer's back up again. I swear I fixed this earlier today. Like, minimap API. Modes. Toggle small map. Yeah, I've toggled small map off. Right. J toggle off large map. But now I... Just... Why minimap API? I'm already annoyed at this run as it is. Could, do, you, do you have to be like this? Maybe just toggle on small map then. Yeah, that's good. I like it. I like it. God. We got fucking speed down. We got a speed down. Why? <laughs> Did we already get a secret room item? We... No, right? Keeper's kin? Potentially pretty good. Oh. I I just I cannot fathom. The world. Around the world, around the world, around the world, around the world. Keeper's box is Actually a little more useful, yeah. Not much, albeit. Not much, but it is technically a bit more useful. Keeper's Kin is actually... It's not the greatest out I've ever seen. But it is... It is an out. Because we can now destroy rocks to gain spiders that can kill enemies for us. Now, it's a loose out, albeit. But it... You, you you can see where I'm coming from, right? You can kind of see... <gasps> a tears of... Not that that's very useful for us right now. But you can kind of see what I mean, right? It's got the it's got the workings of something useful. Anyways, let's get the hell out of this floor. And promptly die upon reaching the next floor. I, I just... Speed down. 
a speed down. Why? Why do I even take pills? I only took it because I was going to get a charge out of it. Like, the qu basically, my question is at the minute, do I ever shoot? Is there is there ever a reasonable circumstance in which I shoot? I guess if there's a lot of rocks... Okay, Planetarium, you basically have to save me. I don't know what I... Do you know what? Give me Mercurius and let me just trailblaze this room. Let me get the hell out of here. Wait, why are we firing two bombs now sometimes? What's that about? What the heck? Uh, oh, we got Incubus for a short time there. I see, I see. Go why? Why? Why is there so many look down pills? No, 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 no. Man, I just want to blow up the fucking skulls. <laughs> ah, this is the most frustrating thing in the world. Just blow up on the enemy, please. <laughs> I only want that for the charge. I, I literally paid for a pip. Right, Planetarium, Mercurius. We need Mercurius. We need, need, need Mercurius. You're gonna give me Mercurius. Festa. I'm pretty sure as well we can't get any more Planetarium items. Oh! Oh my god. We need infestation too, so badly. I need money. Infestation two would be yet another half decent out. Dude, don't jump directly on me. That's it's not on. N no nobody everybody hated that. Oh my lord. I am untethered, and my rage knows no bounds. Two, one. Hey, why didn't I duplicate? Why didn't I get four? I have tarot cloth, right? Okay, this is a good room for us. We can stack up some spiders. Okay, noted. We can accidentally collide our bombs with the uh, the uh, thingies. Did not think that would be possible, but apparently it is. Okay. I fired a ball, I don't know where it went. Just, yeah, thank you. Half, half soul heart. Temperance, oh God, my voice. Temperance is good because we can blow it up. For potential goodies. Basically, any room that has a large amount of rocks, we have to abuse the shit out of. <laughs> right. Please, I need to speed up. I don't, I don't know what I'm trying to get from the broken planetarium. In fact, I'm almost certain it doesn't work if I try it again, so I'm just not going to try. Mum's wig. Okay, we have a very spider-themed thing going on here if we get Infestation 2 as well. I'm very happy about that because it's, like I said, it's like the only thing that's... It's the only thing that's holding my 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 sanity. Okay, let's let's not go overboard in this room because we've got a kind of a stockpile to use there. Yeah, I, I need three more pennies, game. If you could, if you could. Reach into your cold, dead heart and find it within you to give me just just three measly pennies. I would be in debt to you forever. I'm certain, I'm certain that for some reason or another you can't do that. Imagine having to place a literal bomb to destroy a fire. Fun. 
Yeah, I'm sure there's, a, there's, there's some bizarre reason in which you can't do that for me. Um, magician is something. Okay, let's try and pop these keepers. There's the, there's those pennies. I mean, that's two. We need three. That's not a third one right there, is it now? There is a third one there, but I can't get it. the pennies. Let the spiders do the work. Let the spiders do the work. It's all on them. Pretend we're not even here. Do you know what? D20? It's got potential. Like, it's not that good, but I think we can make it work. So obviously, it's not great because we, we don't really want to be re-rolling our pickups when I just pick them up. But, if we get more value out of the pickups we do want, then that's fine. Right, let's go and get Infestation 2 if it's still there. I think it should be. Okay. Infestation 2 is pretty good. One thing I'm unsure of. Are Keeper's Kin Spiders and Infestation 2 Spiders from different classification? Because if they are, that will mean that Infestation 2, uh, sorry, um, Keeper's Kin spiders will be able to create Infestation 2 spiders, which is my hope. That's very wishful thinking, though. Oh, what in the Lord is that? Plus three damage. That's awesome. That's the sort of thing I desperately needed. Yep, yep, yep. So, obviously, rooms like this become a little harder because we can't actually fucking get our spiders to hit. Bomb here. Right. <sighs> Horror Babylon is really good, too. Mainly because it's a speed upgrade. God damn, our horns look disgusting. <laughs> they look horrible. Why are they so fleshy? Ugh. Do they normally look like that? They, they, they are gross. Right, let's let, let the pain continue. Also, D20 does mean we can reroll hearts if, there are, if there's a lot of them in a room. Oh, please. Please, please let us get enough money for Luminary Flare. That'd be so fun on this run. It's also themed around this character too, which just would be cool. I'm gonna take a potential risk here. It's, it's, more, it's more than a potential risk. It is a risk. I'm gonna do it though. Get in here. Unfortunately, I cannot. I cannot in good faith use you. That was unfortunately very worthless. Right. Oh, this is a bad room. This is a bad room. I how how have I not been hit yet? Some some absolute wizardry went down to make that happen. I think the bomb actually is doing contact damage upon passing through enemies. I don't know if that's the thing that normally happens, or if that's like a thing specific to this character. Good though, I like it. Right, use a regular bomb here. Honestly, keep, I have to say, Keeper's Kin is insanely good. Right, do not use that because it can teleport you to an error room, and you just know for a fact that this is the sort of room where it's going to do that to me. Stars. I don't even really know why I attempted that. Penny. See, Blue Streak's interesting. Blue Streak's interesting. I will take it. Yes, this is the hope. It was in the hope of getting more items like this. More health, good.
Cracked Crown? Yes, please. Especially for that damage. Right. The problem being now, we have to, we have to get all the way back without getting hit. We have to. Otherwise, we lose all of our money. That's what Blue Streak does. But Blue Streak is really good because if we don't get hit, which is looking to be unlikely, oh my lord. Yeah, if we don't get hit, we get a massive speed boost and we get more money. I think more money on a run like this is kind of important. Right. Damn it. My heart. My poor, feeble heart. But, Luminary Flare. Now, I'm noticing there's no flare. So, we're going to go take a look at this and make sure it actually works this character. Because otherwise I'm going to be real sad. Um, right, Luminary Flare. Effects. Yeah, so I'm not sure, because it, it, whoa, the fuck? It occupies the same space as the black hole. The black hole seems to be taking precedent. I'm not sure if Luminary, luminary Flare is going to work. I would be severely sad if it doesn't, though. I really do think it should. Considering it's an item from the same mod. I, oh, there you go. There you go. It does. It's just a black beam instead. It's a black hole flare this time. Oh, why did I fire towards me? It's always going to be a bad idea. Literally never ever do that under any circumstance. That was awful. Oh, the double pennies. Yes. Is that a Spelunky 2 dude? I think it is, isn't it? I'm going to look real dumb if it's not. Sideways face, boy. Health is looking pretty good, actually. Pretty happy with health right now. Yeah, it's, we, we basically have to set ourselves up to just AFK the run. <laughs> we need to, like, not be involved in any of the processes that are involved in. Whoa, transform all items into glitched items. Ooh, I've never seen that before. That is our secret room, nice. Rules card, always fun. Crawl space, was not expecting that. I do think this is worth trying. Yeah, okay, push pin's not really worth it, but there you go. Uh, we really need to try and blow up these, these blue, fly, blue fires here, so let's do that. This, this fucking block. Sad. Right. This is, a, this is sort of a, one of our, our biggest challenges yet. We did lose a lot of money there. Good thing about Blue Streak, actually. We, we do drop money on the floor when we get hit, which obviously we lose a lot of our maximum money, but it charges our active item and we re-pick it back up. So. Silver lining, I guess. I... What, what the hell hit me that time? Tell me, game. What? This is so painful. But we did it. Right. We're gonna take... I didn't randomize, so it doesn't matter. I think we... We need to take this with a permanent Polaroid invincibility. Then we pop Singularity here. Oh, Mr. Dolly. You absolute lovely bastard we even get another charge out of that too even better and then why not pop that and see what we get okay this this is going way better than it should be right now <laughs> there, there there's an elegance to this there's a certain je ne sais quoi so to say about this run oh my god do you know what? Something I've been neglecting is our current ability to just bomb our way out of rooms if they're too hard. Really should be considering this option a little more. The main reason I'm not is because we still need items and we're not going to get items unless we uh, cra uh, like craft stuff. I do believe that on the on the womb we cannot craft items in regular rooms anymore. We can only craft items in the boss room, devil deal and angel deal. And then on the floors past that we can't craft at all. 
So I, I think I think this this guy is someone we have to play. We can end up spending a lot of bombs here, but we need a bomb upgrade. Is what I'm saying. You watch him not pay out somehow. We don't have much luck, so that won't help. But dude, bomb beggars and battery beggars. I swear they they made their payout rate just insultingly low. But yes, uh, using Singularity here won't do anything. Okay. That's so good. Although, might be increasing the blast radius on us too, which is not so good. But yeah, pop that, it doesn't do anything. I just wanted to make sure of that. But yeah, this is really good. We, we, got a, we just got a huge damage increase. It's more, I, honestly, the damage increase isn't even that big of a deal. It's the blast radius. The blast radius being able to destroy uh, rocks easier and stuff is going to be so good. Uh, we got a hanged man here. Nice. Oh, that, nah, I want to keep this. I've got to. I've got to try, because now that we can actually read what glitched items do. Oh, that was so stupid. So stupid. Okay, so we're doing good contact damage with the bombs. I think that's because it's got piercing, maybe. Does piercing just add good contact damage? I really don't know. This is a new one that I've not had to deal with before. I've never had to, when having Dr. Fetus, consider my bombs' um, contact damage before. <laughs> it's, it's never been at the forefront of my mind. Because why would it ever be? Right. Oh, that was so dumb. I thought the enemy was dead. It was not. Dude, the blast radius, come on now. Good. Get those spurters. This is a really, really, really hard enemy for us to hit, naturally. Even harder when it does shit like that. Yeah, 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 you hit me. Well fucking done. Everything about this is just utter and complete pain. Why is the brimstone ghosts on this floor? Who 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 is doing this? What? That one wasn't reflected. You screwed me, game. Ipecac mod. Blue streak. You screwed me. It wasn't reflected, but it. Oh, you bastard. Right. I wish we had more money for this. Please give us at least one soul heart. Come on. Bastard. Very, very scared right now. Angel deal. Divine intervention is kind of useless. Scapula! is potentially. Oh, fuck. I did not mean to activate you. Sweet, sweet child of mine. Right, we carry on. This has been insane. This has just been a roller coaster of immersions. Oh, dude! That. L I'm getting very frustrated. That lump just popped up right next to me. Wow. Right, be careful of the polyps things in this floor. Item. Oh, we don't have any money, though. Bastard.
Rooms like this, I just, I, I can't afford to fire. Like, until I know it's safe sort of thing. What the fuck? How did that hit me? I was nowhere near that. This game's racist as shit. This is hell. That fucking penny better kill you. Don't know how I got it. Like, I saw the plum, the plum shot coming in. Like, don't get me wrong, I did see that. But I, I thought I was nowhere near it. No, bomb, no. Oh my god. Oh my god. I really need to be using my D20 a little more to try and get myself some advantages. Really, when I have no fucking money, it's like spawning me a shop at every second room. I am going to, I am going to beat hybrid in the face. Oh, we need that. We need that. That right there, we need that. Don't know why I did that. I've got to go back and do some extra rooms because I need 8 cent to buy that. That is incredibly valuable. Because we have their blue streak, so we can keep it alive reasonably easily. Do you know what? Let's, uh, let's check for a secret room. I can't fathom the amount of just stress in my life right now. Yes. Right, back we go. Around the world and back again. Please be filled when we pick it up. It's not even filled. I could have left a penny on the floor. Boy, buy that hope for a penny. Yes. Okay. This could be our saving grace. With blue streak, I reckon we're in with a good shot here. This is it's kind of a game break on its own. Okay, we picked up this one. Okay, so up we go. Man, my fucking heart. I can't take this. This is insane. Okay, so we want to leave pennies on the ground just in case. Really should have been using my singularity in the previous uh, flaws there. That was a big mistake on my behalf. Dude, 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 dude. Dude, 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 dude. No, 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 no. <laughs> you little... Shyster. Okay, okay. The the penny strat, the penny, the pe the penny, penny, the penny strat is actually pretty effective. I didn't expect it to be as good as it is. I was only hopeful. I I, I was just yeah. I was just hopeful. It seems I was I was correct. Right. We're in a situation now where we can no longer really rely on our rock spiders. Because remember that the next floor has very few or no rocks on it whatsoever. Okay, we're up to full speed here, that's good. I I really don't like this situation here. Yeah. That hit me. Ooh, of course it did. Ooh, baby. Eternal heart. Why? 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 Why buy the key? I did not want to buy that key in any way, shape, or form. I, I legitimately don't know if I've ever been this stressed in my life. Even though the run is... What is this room, by the way? How am I not going to get hit by these things? Oh my lord. Um, yeah, like, even though the run is in, like, a reasonably good spot now, 
Next floor is the true test. And you look at our, uh, our penny heart too. It's like all the way. Well, one thing I just have to try real quick. Can oh God, I forgot about those. Can I cheese this? I reckon I can slightly cheese this. It, the, the developer's likely a smart person, but, 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 damn it. They're too smart for me. I was seeing if I could reorder the uh, thing by dropping it and picking it back up, but I did think smart developer would think of that already. That's a pretty obvious, not break, but a pretty obvious cheese. Luminary Flare's also been, like, kind of a godsend. Like, every time an enemy dies, there's a chance that basically another enemy or two die as well. And then that, en that enemy dying can trigger more enemies dying. It's just, it's a nice little chain we got going on. This is a hellish room. Just, just, just stay still. Oh, wait, the, the coin heart empties first. Nice. It just did. Like, even even though I've got soul hearts there. Maybe that's just an error in the coding behalf then. It's, it's just not visually showing up at the end of the health, even though it should. Honestly, game-breaking trinket for us. I'm, I'm a lot less scared knowing that this that, that works that way now. Because as long as we can pick up the pennies from Blue Streak, we are essentially in invincible. I think it's about time we uh, we give this in. And we get the golden apple, which I'm just going to corrupt and see what we get. On hitting an enemy, chance to deal damage, then gain two spooky, then convert all hearts in the room into a conjoined spitty, then deal damage, and then gain a little haunt. Sadly, not good. Anything that's going to spawn enemies on us, don't think we can really realistically take. Right. Empty heart container there, nice. Ooh. Right, stock up on spiders in this room. This is our last chance. Get in there. This is kind of a, a tough boss to hit. Okay, that works quite well. I got hit, but don't worry. I re-picked up the penny and I'm good to go. Good thing is, boss damage from bombs is pretty high. We're out of spiders now, so that makes things a little tougher. We got him. In we go. Right. I... The, 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 the just trial that I have been through. The ordeal. Turtle baby to end it off. Hell yes. Book of Revelations is pretty nice here. Turtle baby to end it off. How very fun. Conj. <laughs> Why? Why, game? Stop with this. You're funny, aren't you? You're funny. Yeah, I'm fucked. Okay, just... Always remember to grab the, um, this is such a difficult situation. Always remember to grab the pennies and we'll always be fine. Especially with Polar Invincibility. I genuinely can't hit these bastards. Like, I have not even hit this boss one shit. Come on now. No, why did I do that? Oh shit, shit, shit. Why did it not drop a penny? It didn't drop a penny this time. I thought it always dropped a penny. Dude, this room's so difficult. <laughs> I can't hit these bloody, bloody motherfuckers. Why is it two stains? Okay, without our penny strat, we're in the hole. We are in the hole. Because we have conjoined now. That is not good. <laughs> Give me a damn penny. <laughs> By any means necessary, give me a penny. What? In the jism just hit me. Dude, why is the spiders? No. 
Dude, why are my bombs doing so little damage? Pennies, pennies, I need it. Thank you. Like, I can't damage this guy. What the hell's going on? I'm just going to have to let, you, let, let nature run its course for that one. You may be wondering, Turtle, why are you still picking up items? And it's because I ain't no bitch. God damn. So stressful. Like, I'm kind of on a time limit as well, because I'm meant to be going out very shortly, and I think my girlfriend's already home. I think I heard someone come in, so... Oh my god. Oh, what you little shit. You shyster. I was thinking Golden Razor would have been really good, and then I realized we literally never have any money. Dude, this, this boss... This boss is going to be him. Secret room there? If that penny is not... Yeah, I can say that penny doesn't disappear. It's the same right there. Same with those. Same right there. We have the Magician, which is kind of the thing that I'm relying on. To keep us going. I think for the boss fight itself. What is with these weird champions? For the boss itself, that should be pretty good. Right, this room can take care of itself. We're so close to greatness. Man. It's the wrong fucking way. Why? Why is it the wrong way? I told you, game. I'm on a time limit, you fucking bitch. Oh, my lord. Fuck you. God, this is a very swear-heavy episode. Right. You know that? See, this is why we left the pennies. This is why we left the pennies, people. Got a renewable source now. Just in case. Now that I know that that can happen to us. See, over, over the course of this run, I have gotten a lot better at handling our bombs. I mean, even with Conjoined, we're not hitting ourselves that much. But, still. I mean, one thing that's definitely not helping is our just absurdly high shot speed. Or maybe that's... I can't tell if that's hindering or helping, actually. It might actually be the thing that's saving us. Ow. Sigil. Sigil's pretty good here. Um, I'm going to take this instead, though. Jeez. Holy shit. That might be the legitimate hardest I've ever had to fight for a win. And I am damn proud that I did it. I hope you guys enjoyed that, and I'll see you guys in the next one.